And hello everybody, welcome back to the video. Today we are in Parkour Illusion. Uh, it, it already looks trippy from up here. Um, I'm guessing, yeah, the, the inside probably won't look all that weird, but... Still, it's, it's a pretty cool concept of a map, you know? It's supposed to be a big, like, illusionary thing. I'm a little unsure exactly what it's supposed to be, but... I don't, I don't know that much about illusions i'm gonna be honest so and i'm guessing you probably only get a view of the illusion from the top which makes me kind of wish that they had done the starting menu like oh oh never mind those black bars oh you know at the start they had said hey put your gui scale on three or whatever and i looked at them and was like or four sorry i i, I have it on three I was just like, no. I'm guessing that's that's why. Yeah, because all of these are gonna. Oh, if I press F1 for it, it'll. Okay. Yeah, it'll be fine. I just gotta press F1 before I go into any of the tubes so that it doesn't mess with it. I get the idea. Like, it, it's definitely pretty neat. But the fact that your GUI scale messes with it. Oh, there was. Nothing for that one. <laughs> I don't know. The fact your GUI scale messes with, messes with me. But, like, I, I... Click on the small mushroom. Which... Which small? Um... Oh, this one. Hello? No? Is that not right? Which mushroom am I supposed to click on? What? Hello? What? <laughs> Excuse me. Wait, which 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 small mushroom game? Oh, this one. Okay, that could have been a little more explanatory. But yeah, I, I GUI scale of force just ugly. I think that's probably the best way to put it. I just I, I hate how it looks. Oh. Huh? Okay, is that gonna happen again? I think maybe maybe that'll help. Bro, that did, that did not help. I cannot hear myself think. Let me out. Bro, that was a horrible. I don't know how loud that was over the video, because I'm guessing that peaked out on OBS. Oh, that's going to kill me. But that was insane. Like, that was, that was nothing short of stupid, how loud that was. <laughs> um, okay, I have... I have I have no response to that. They haven't done any of the cinematic stuff since then. Oh, that's pretty neat. <laughs> Map's so weird. Like it keeps going between like being Oh, I was supposed to go back around. It keeps going between like being really well made and then just randomly completely stupid. Oh, the fire doesn't actually burn me. Yeah, I, I can't see anything with the fire though. Like, it's really weird, because some what in Happen. Uh, some of the elements. Why am I in survival? Why am I in creative? What? Oh, I thought I was in survival because I could see this stuff, but not, <laughs> I put into create. I'm so confused. The world is happening. Uh, this this makes no sense. It's like it's it's such a weird mix between being suddenly really well made at spots and then other areas just being like really really struggling. I find it I find it interesting in its own right. Oh whoops. 
Cause like, I don't know. I, the elytra's still on, and it has curse of binding, so I can't even take it off. Bruh, I hate doing parkour with elytra's on. I I don't know. Like as as I was saying, it, it's it's such a weird mix between being like really well made and then all of a sudden cutting to just like really poorly put together, and I don't understand why. Especially since the map creator, like, at the start, even... Well, like, th this map creator had made a couple maps. Am I not supposed to land there? And it takes me all the way back here? Because I don't get any check... What? I'm so confused. I guess I was supposed to run... I was supposed to fly through that whole thing? But, um, as I was saying, there's some map creators in the, like, credits and stuff at the start that have done stuff for a while. This, this map creator's made several maps. I'm just like really confused why some of the basic elements of just you know really I don't want to say simple things I've never made a map so I can't particularly comment on what's simple to add but some of the things that have become very standard across parkour maps just like aren't here right, let's just slow down what was that? What, what was that? All right, if I if I die again in a stupid spot, we're gonna skip past the elytra bit, cause that's that's just stupid. It, 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 does it have like a speed limiter where if you go slow enough, it kills you? So confused. I don't I don't know. Really weird. Alright, I'm guessing I'm supposed to head over here. Please don't kill me. Okay, it didn't kill me. Is the elytra gone? Thank goodness the elytra's gone. Alright, we have to collect four materials. Um guessing I should probably go around this way. Uh, uh Okay, I'll go to the mushrooms. <laughs> The invisible blocks being in the way feel. Alright, there is one material down. I'm guessing there's another over here. There's another over here. There is two materials down. Uh one over here. Ah, that that one actually had invisible blocks in the way. Alright, let's go this way. <laughs> I'm so confused. Uh you know, I, I haven't played a map in a long time where I've just been like Questioning everything. I find most maps nowadays are pretty well made. Um, oh, probably here. So like, it, it's it's almost never a problem with this sort of stuff anymore. But occasionally, there's still a map where they miss some stuff, and I don't know if it's like like I don't want to be mean to the map creator because I don't know why necessarily they missed up. It's possible that the map creator just missed something, you know? But, um... Go off of this. Probably not over there. Uh... Hello? Oh, probably down. Yeah, there we go. But, uh, anyway, as I was saying, um... I, there's just a lot of things that have become... That, that, that have become pretty standard and it becomes very like weird to play maps that don't have them. I've been here before. Wait, does this mean I ended up in the wrong spot when I came up here? Wait, what? We're gonna go here. <laughs> I, I've taken a couple areas the wrong way. Okay, that, that leads to that. I've gotten that. Uh... What else do I need then? Go. Oh. To be. Wait, this is the last thing I need. Never mind. <laughs> oh. Alright. Where was that at? Back over this way, I presume? I don't know. I, I didn't pay very close attention to where exactly it was at. What the? Oh, is all of this just lethal over here? 
Yeah, well, that's just lethal over there. So yeah, I'm guessing it's not back that way. Uh, <laughs> okay. Uh, all the invisible blocks are so annoying. Okay, it's just over here. Um, and we're to the end section now. All right. What the? Okay. That was that was just me being bad. I, it, it's maps like this though that remind me why I hate the over usage of invisible blocks. Like there's times where it's necessary, like blocking off an area where somebody could cheese past a large portion of the level that you're clearly not supposed to go to. But um. When there's an area that's like, oh, this looks like where I'm supposed to go, and then, oh, red sand's over here. Um, maybe? And, but if there's an area that really looks like it's where you're supposed to go, and then you're not able to actually go there because of invisible blocks, it just gets really old really fast. And once again, if there's an area that, like, you look at and you're like, oh, I can cheese that. That's clearly not where I'm supposed to go, but I'm going to try and go there anyway. And there's invisible blocks and it's like, all right, yeah, that's fair game. But when there's an area that looks like it's where you're supposed to go and invisible blocks cut you off, it's just kind of, kind of annoying. This is very clearly not where I'm supposed to go, but... <laughs> Whatever, going up the vines, it is what it is. Uh, am I supposed to go from here? Oh, am I supposed to go around the trees? What? I don't, I don't understand. Huh? Why, why did the screen just go black for a second? I don't understand what's happening, but I think this is the end. This, yeah, this is, this is the end. And I'm in creative again. What in the world happened? <laughs> all right, all right. You know, I I don't know. I don't, I don't know what else to say. I, I've played some of the more recent maps from this map creator, and he's definitely improved a lot. I think that's probably the best note to end it on. Anyway, guys, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed. And, yeah, I will see you all in the next one. God bless. Bye-bye.